Well, hello everyone, and welcome back. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about Talk Like a Pirate Day, and that is why we're here today. If you're new around here, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button, and of course, leave the video with a like. So we're just going through the collection chest. Obviously, do that in your own free time. We're not going to go through all the items as of yet, because these always get updated. But we do appear to have a collection chest within a collection chest, which has just absolutely blown my mind. Anyway, let us move on to join pirates. We're going to be going through some of the must-get talk like a party items from past events so we'll be looking at a lot of the seasonal gear and when there's something relevant when I show you the list because we'll be using the wiki list I will of course ping it up on screen if I particularly like an armor or a weapon or a pet etc now one of the most important things you should be doing is speaking to Barnaby about the celestial pirate captain and in this quest you will see you have got Polly Roger don't forget you will get a char page badge for completing this one so it's definitely worth it but Polly Roger is that damage boosting pet it gives you 30 boost to humans chaos dragons and there's another couple on there but it's definitely worth it so make sure you're grabbing it because it's only here for a few weeks during talk like a pirate day anyway let us move on to join blazebeard where you've got this merge shop and yes there is the alpha pirate but of course you'll have to ioda any items that you need in order to get that but in case you do randomly have you know something lurking in the bank for it why not go and grab it but more importantly we've got loads of armors helms capes and and all sorts in case you did want to get yourself all dressed up as a pirate don't worry there'll be AC tagged stuff later on if you continue through the map you will come to a pirate ship and downstairs within here you can go to the left and you'll go through to the pirate captain however I don't have the required item because I'm an idiot and delete these things there is no classy naval armor drop but if you did want to get it you can still obtain it through an IODA of the 2020 collection chest which I just showed you anyway join heart of the sea and you can defeat this giant fish guy and once you do defeat him, you have a chance at getting some of these items. Nothing too much to blow your socks off, but just worth mentioning. Join Cetolian War and you can defeat this ginormous jellyfish for quite a variety of AC tag gear. Now, a couple of my favourites are the Skull Pet, but that's members only, and also the Faro one next to it that you can currently see on the screen. Let's move on to our next one. This is Join Laguna Beach and you've got some chaos themed gear around here. So this is definitely worth having a look at. We also have some color custom armors in case you did want those. As you can see, they are trimmed to me. Or at least I think they are. Either that or they're bright blue. One or the other. Either I'm right or I'm wrong. Then you've got loads and loads of helms as per usual in merge shops. A mixture of AC tagged and just free player items. And then we can continue through the map to this boss who has some really nice pirate gear. Again, there's no armor dropping from this one. But don't worry we have plenty of armor drops coming up and yes they are mostly pirate ones but just in case you wanted to know what pirate morph look like this is it on screen and it is one of my favorite helms i think it's because of the glowing purple eyes Anyway, we are now going to join a Dragon Pirate. Yet another half-decent merge shop. Loads of AC tagged items that you can go through and grab if you did want to. These weapons are actually pretty cool. And I do like it when you have these kind of runic anchor things or whatever they're called. You know, what we were just looking at a minute ago. I don't even know what to call them half the time. I could actually just read the descriptions on these, I know. But sometimes it's nice just to tell you how my brain thinks and is working at that moment in time when I'm looking at something. Because it's that kind of authentic feel. Anyway. Anyway, if you advance on through this map, we're going for a little wander. I don't know why I've decided to show you the wander, just a bit of scenery for a change. You'll get to this boss with lots and lots of items. There are multiple armor drops you can get, which I'm just about to ping up on screen for you. You've got the gothic pirate, the lightning pirate, and another armor right at the bottom that I'm also going to show you. Just the Serpent Warrior is the last one you can grab from there, so it's definitely worth going along and farming him for a little bit if you haven't already. That first monster that you can get a pet version of what we just literally walked past down here at Join Hidden Depths, but you can also still get this black pirate costume, which is really underrated in my opinion, and it looks really, really nice. It's sort of like a formal pirate, so definitely worth grabbing if you have a spare moment of your time. Next up, we are under the sea yet again at Pirate War, where you can get a load of corrupted weapons. That's pretty much it. The red pirate costume is now rare, so you will not be getting that, so don't hang around waiting for that drop forever. Join 
Ruined Mana Cannon, again, lots of items, including Blades, Beards, Armor. It's another room that I haven't yet unlocked, so just progress through the quest here, and you'll eventually get through to him. On screen was the Jolly Roger pet that I was showing you, and Blades, Beards, Armor as well. Next up, we have Join Kaiju War, and as you can see, you've got some rewards off of these quests. You may already have some of these items if you've completed the event in the past, but you can go through, defeat the monster on screen, and again, you'll get some drops. And then there's further drops as well from the big boss. You can see loads of Deep Dweller stuff including the Deep Dweller Pirate Armor. How cool is that one? Again, we have had some really nice armor drops throughout this. So guys, that's it for now. Thank you all very much for watching. I may be back with more Talk Like a Pirate Day items soon that may be worth you going through and getting in-game, so maybe treat this potentially as a part one. But until next time, leave this video a like, and I'll see you all again incredibly soon.